The Crusader prototype 155mm self-propelled howitzer was developed as a replacement for the M109S6 Paladin. The U.S. Army requires about 800 new vehicles of this type. The new artillery system was trialed in 1999. The Crusader was planned to enter service in 2008. However the program was terminated in 2002 because the prototype did not met mobility and precision expectations. Technologies developed for the Crusader were used to produce lighter and more deployable XM-1203 NLOSC non-line-of-sight cannon. The XM-2001 Crusader is fitted with a 155mm howitzer, fitted with a fully automatic loading system. Maximum rate of fire is 10 rounds per minute and is capable of multiple rounds simultaneous impact firing. A single Crusader self-propelled howitzer can fire up to 8 rounds to hit a single target at the same time. It was claimed that Crusader has a maximum range of fire in excess of 40 kilometers. However by the look of its long gun, which is way longer than that of the M109S6, it would be safe to assume that this artillery system could reach around 50 kilometers, and possibly even 60 to 70 kilometers with special ammunition. A South African G6-52 artillery system, that was introduced in 2003, had a range of 67 kilometers with special rocket-assisted projectiles. So most likely that the Crusader was also capable of such range. A total of 48 rounds are carried. A battery of six Crusaders can deliver 15 tons of ammunition in less than five minutes. This artillery system has a crew of three. The Crusader sends and receives real-time battlefield information through Advanced Battlefield Management System. In general the Crusader is considered to be twice more effective comparing with the M109S6 Paladin. Armor of the XM2001 provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Vehicle is also fitted with integrated active defense system. NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems were present on this vehicle. Vehicle was to be powered by a new LV100-5 gas turbine engine, developing 1,500 horsepower. Honeywell International and General Electric were selected to develop a smaller, lighter, quieter moving gas turbine engine with rapid acceleration. Two Crusaders can be carried on a C-5 or C-17 transport aircraft. The Crusader was resupplied from an XM-2002 ammunition resupply vehicle. The XM-2002 could automatically transfer up to 48 rounds of ammunition and fuel in less than 12 minutes under armor in a contaminated environment. The XM-2002 itself could be fully loaded with 110 rounds in fuel in less than an hour. Despite its impressive performance, the Crusader program was terminated. One of the reasons was excessive weight and lack of mobility. Crusader weights nearly as much as two paladins. This artillery system was troublesome to transport. However technologies developed for the Crusader were later used to produce lighter and more deployable XM-1203 NLOSC and other US artillery systems, such as M109A7 and XM-1299.